Poa Post is a for-profit courier postal service that seeks to help bridge the urban-rural divide in Kenya and Eastern Africa through a mobile application that will connect courier to customer that will assist in delivering packages such as medicine, food items, clothing, etc. 81 million is the number of poor in India. Two to three thousand are the number of welfare programs in India. And there is no way for a poor person to find out about all these welfare programs across the three or four thousand departments. Enter Yojana Wiki, which helps the poor navigate through this cross-section of different welfare programs through its very simple user-friendly website. And we also help the poor to actually navigate the process of getting these benefits. The name of our startup is Urban Watchers. We are creating a mobile crowdsourcing application that will offer information and real-time alerts to citizens on their neighborhood based on city level news and reports that any user can generate. Um, we found through our um, almost 50 countries that we've traveled to um, and six years of living and working uh, in countries all around the world that it's not about the program, it's not about the set itinerary, it's really about the people that you meet along the way. So Taranga is a new way to travel. It's about connecting with people who have mutual passions and getting off the beaten path when you travel. Our project was actually born from a class at SIPA about a year ago um, with Sarah Menard and she actually cemented this uh, inclination towards social entrepreneurship in all of us. Remit Mas is a cash to savings digital money transfer service that offers Latino immigrants a new way to remit. Our customers will have the ability to send money and allocate it into different savings wallets for their families' education, health, and housing needs. I think our project really relates to what the Dean's Policy Challenge is trying to seek, which is solving urban policy problems. Whereas ours is particularly unique, is unlike the other uh, competition uh, competitors, we're actually focused on America, on a, a unique policy problem here, which is struggling community organisations. Community spaces is Airbnb for venues. We're trying to connect communities with their venues and the same way around for the venues themselves. We know across America there are hundreds of thousands of community venues struggling to make ends meet and we want to give them a new source of revenue. Well, should we win, <laughs> we would build one poll post outlet in our pilot uh, county where we did all our data, base, our data research and our needs-based assessment. In Chelsea, we've uh, been in touch with a church called St. Peter's. Uh, a lot of their space is underutilized at the moment and we want to bring people into that space and we want to broaden that model and take it out to America. If we are lucky enough to win, the next step for us would be to develop the application. We, are already, we already have a prototype that we will test but after those tests, we want to launch. So Remit Moss has become part of our day-to-day -day lives inside and outside of SIBA. Some people say remittances are dollars wrapped with love. We're inspired by the passion in the travel community and we're inspired to make travel more impactful.